what the poop happened to the music anyway? Maybe it's because I have that stopwatch now or something like that. I don't know. Yeah, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. So it's, uh, yeah, it's, you know, it's four o'clock according to that watch that I just set that I won from the watery driving range. Yes, yes. Oh, no. So, oh, wait, oh, wait, hold on, hold on. I got a watch for you. You can check the time yourself. <clears throat> oh, look at that. It's knockoff time, and bodyguard is gone. <laughs> so it looks like I've cleared out all the quests around here then, I guess. And here we are. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. It's always great to be here at the, um, the, the uh, <clears throat> where are we again? Great, Bermuda Isles, <laughs> of course, of course. His reputation is going down the pooper as we're speaking. I always love playing the Bermuda Isles. Today I'm testing out a brand new club from Pure Strike. That's the poster that we've seen on the back wall of our house. Let's take a look at how it performs. Oh, so he's doing like a sponsored ad for them. That's pretty powerful, but not super accurate. That, that's giving me 10 yards at least. If you squint your eyes, you'll notice the grooves are diagonal. Oh! Oh. Oh. I don't know if that's a good thing or not. This promotes something called transrotational friction, which causes the ball to spin on a third axis and roll further. <laughs> oh, well, I don't, I don't know about that. It also lowers horizontal dispersion by one standard deviation. Wow! It's going in the bag, folks. Yeah, this is sounding like a commercial. Are we happy? <laughs> good effort. The boys in marketing have been toying with the term unbound. Uh, what? How do you, how do you, Incorporate that. Okay, let's do another. I'm gonna say unbound power or something like that. Well, that was actually better than the last. This club feels like pure distance. Unbound, yes. <laughs> unbound by the laws of physics. That should do it. Let's wrap it up. Ah, let's, let's wrap. Everyone go home. This club review was made possible by the kind people at Pure Strike. Keep tuning in for more honest club reviews. Well, I don't know if I call it honest, but we'll see about that. That'll do it. And the club back, Max. Oh! <laughs> hey, Max. How oh, did you slip by? <laughs> it's cats out of the bag. Thank you for your support. Max is interacting with fans today. We sort of met earlier at Wellworn Grove. Hey! Keep it down. Now, what do you want? I want to invite you to our long drive competition. Lorraine? Max is not interested. Oh, <laughs> I see. She's like his agent, and she kind of does the decisions for him. He has other commitments. Is that all? Hmm? Can I have a turn of that club? No. Quite a moment, Lorraine. We're not seeing it used by an amateur. Go on, then. Have a crack, young feller. Thanks. <laughs> okay, turn those cameras off. Something tells me we're gonna outdo him. I won't outdrive him, but maybe he will be impressed if I use Coach's hot potato shot. How did he do that again? Wasn't it something about, yeah, like throwing it up and then pressing, mm hmm. So we're gonna do our own soda hot potato. Whoa! That was terrible. <laughs> you didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. Oh, it's gonna take me a bit to get the timing again. Yeah. I think I could have to do a little bit later than that. Yeah, that was too late. <laughs> oh, it's getting worse. Okay, maybe I should try earlier. Oh, no, no, no one's seen anything. Just getting a feel for it. <laughs> yes, as I, that, that's exactly what I said too. I gotta get a feel for it again. <laughs> Come on, hot potato, hot potato. <laughs> It looks like that one looked like it had a top spin. Oh, that's it! That's it right there! Yeah! Okay. I wish I could practice that more. Like, I don't know if you can do that all the time, like anywhere that you want. Wow! Yes, impressive indeed. It must be the diagonal grooves. <laughs> a cheap trick, nothing more. Will you be competing at the long drive competition? I could try. I plan to. Fine, I'll see you there. We'll see what happens in a real golfing event. Ooh. Ooh. It was a good day of training, yes. Training. 
<laughs> it's nice to get out and relax sometimes. But I wasn't only here to relax. No? I was actually trying to teach you a lesson today. I doubt that. It's important that you, you don't take your training too seriously. Well, that is actually a, a decent lesson, I'll give him that. Once upon a time, I, all I cared about was golf. And now, because of that, I have nothing left worth caring for. Mm -hmm. Coach, what happened? I just told you, I cared about golf too much. <laughs> sure, there's probably more to it. I'll try to get more out of them later, yeah. Just make sure you never forget those who are important to you. Of course not. And we probably nap in our bed or something. Yep. Let's see our pros, uh, pure strike poster on the back wall once again. Probably. Hmm. Hmm. Loading. <laughs> oh, it poops us over here. Okay. Uh, I want to buy a pie, mate. Cook them myself. I should. Uh, so I guess I'm supposed to do something in here. Probably over at Lucky's office. I did it. Max Yards is confirmed for the long drive competition. How did you convince him? Nothing special, really. He was quite eager to join. <laughs> Just a little impressed by my hot potato shot. Looks like you actually managed to get everything together. Now all that's left to do is wait for the long drive competition to roll around. It will be good to get a bit of rest in. Afraid not. I need to teach you how to long driver. Ooh. Meet me on the range. Are we gonna learn like a power shot? Like in Mario Golf? Oh. <laughs> okay, to the range we go. Let me guess. Let me guess. You're gonna tell us not to do anything. Don't go causing trouble. Yeah. Yeah. Hope you never forget how much I've done for you. Yes, you've, t you've done so much. Uh, still no skin. It said the following day, so. Thought maybe I could check the computer again for maybe more videos or something like that. Hmm, what if there's more side quests around here? Eh, eh, later. Oh wait, no, this isn't the driving range area. This is the start of a hole. Oh wait, 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 wait. Hold on, I should actually go and check to see if I can beat this challenge now because I increased my drive further. I'm not gonna spend an hour on it. <laughs> I'm just gonna take a take one one actual chance at it, you know, like a, a couple of swings to see if I can actually pull it off. Uh, well, I could use the power of the wind to getting under the ball. I do see a little dis little difference in my distance there, because I'm getting over the rough with on the fly with ease here, and... Oh, well, uh, uh, okay. Okay, I'm not gonna change my impact area this time, you know, the hit zone. I'm just gonna aim straight for it and see what happens. Don't go in the bunker, please. Ah, really? Are you telling me I still can't do it? Even after all this time? Okay, I'm gonna try the... I'll try the wind one. Wait, wait, no, no. Top spin. And see if I can get more roll out of this. Ah, that was pretty good. Go, 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 yeah, I can do it! <laughs> Unless it won't count because of the mole, but I think it does count. Yes! Yes! We finally did it! You a pro or something, mate? <laughs> so it does give a, a little bit of extra oomph. You're a legend. Alright, so that is a side quest we can cross off for lists. Although I still wonder if there's a rainbow hole back at the Bermuda Isles, but I didn't see anything when I was hitting balls around there randomly at the very least. Uh, I'm gonna do a little tour around the area here, see if anyone's gotten more dot dot dots above their head. How about you two? And also, can I replay the mini golf course? Just out of curiosity. Eh? You broke the course record, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there's no way you're smart enough to be a mini golfer. Uh, can I just like drop a ball and start on my own? No? Oh man. You mean once you beat the mini golf, you can't play it again for like a best score or something? I find that hard to believe. I bet we're gonna unlock like the full mini course. I mean, like the, the replayable mini golf course later. Hey, wait a sec. No, wait, you were there before, weren't you? I haven't attempted the challenge myself. It's quite wasteful. Yeah, the guy that lost or had me lose a bunch of balls. New grass worked perfectly. What do you think? It's nice. Thought you might like it. So, oh, I see. All these 
places were empty before, and now they're filled in with that colored grass from Cheeky Peak Peak. <laughs> I see. Oh, wait, what about this? There's just like a practice bunker. I put on this cane every day. Yeah, and now you got even more grass to put off of. Wait, what is... Is this green or is it... No, that is deep rough. Oh, okay, you've got to cut that. <laughs> That's not a part of that the rectangular green there. Although I guess that could also be technically a chipping practice area, because, you know, practice chipping out of the deep rough. Oh, oh, oh. I never tried that before. <laughs> I would prefer to leave that in, because there's no flag and it's more humorous that way. Uh -huh. yeah, same dialogue from before. Okay, let's move on. Let's get the lesson for a power shot from Coach. You know, I still haven't tried that lower wind shot, you know, when I got that power from earlier. I just, I guess I haven't really felt like I needed it. Time for you to learn to swing a long driver. I'm guessing it's pretty similar to a normal driver. Actually, they couldn't be more different. Mm -hmm. Long driver's four power gauges that you need to hit is four. Ooh, this could actually be something. And then you'll need to press A quickly as it goes back down, so mash the button. Finally hit it once more at the end to set the accuracy. Let's see how you get it on. Uh, oh, what? What? So, do I hit it like way on the far left and then hit the markers on the way back? Or do I hit them on the way through? I guess I'll try it on the way back, because that seems like the most logical. Uh, uh, what? Uh, no, that wasn't right. Okay, I'm gonna try it on the way through. Eh, eh, yeah, that's gotta be it. And then we mash it! <laughs> Holy poopers! I might have. I, I probably should have done this before I, uh. tried that other challenge in the other area. <laughs> now, I, now we got something new here. And now that one have definitely made the green. You're getting the hang of it. I don't know if he'll beat Max Yards tomorrow, but you should do well. You should head home now. Come back tomorrow. Okay. Is it going to make me automatically go to sleep for the day, or... Day of the long drive competition. Is it going to automatically poop me back over there? I feel like I haven't done all that much here. That's the disc jockeys. We didn't realize there was a ball going... <laughs> How can people take in such a boring sport? I guess I'll stick around and see what all the fuss is about. Maybe we'll be able to impress even them. I've got something real special for the winner. <laughs> I can still kick around the balls. Hello. There's no textbook swing of a long driver. You just close your eyes and hope for the best. That's the reason I'm no good at it. <laughs> got fresh pies. I microwaved. Microwaved. That doesn't sound fresh to me. The car just hasn't been the same since the incident. <laughs> Lucky reprimanded me when he saw the state of it. Don't worry, I told him I went off-roading. <laughs> I didn't have time to train with a long driver. Oh wait, is my long driver... Like, do I have a long driver now? Hmm. Or is it just like a specialty driver for the competition? Because in actual real deal long drive competitions, you can use a driver that's like, I think, three inches longer than usual or something like that. I forgot the regulations, but yeah, it's it's longer than the usual, usual driver. Anyway, let's chat. Why are there no short game specific comps? <laughs> well, I, I guess technically there are those side quests and stuff. We have the long driver on the simulator over. No, you didn't! <laughs> Did my back in two, so I won't compete today. Oh, I see. <laughs> Honestly, I find these things a little boring to watch. I already know the result as soon as the ball touches the club face. I doubt that. It's a bit like watching a movie with subtitles in the same language. Uh, I guess I talked to Lucky last. You know, the, the way this, this guy's clothes, I keep forgetting to mention, he looks like gold from Pokemon Gold and Silver, doesn't he? Yeah! Look at everyone be watching Max. Well, I ain't watching. I got no respect for nobody, and I ain't never gonna change. <laughs> Long driver comps are pretty rad. Coach, you won't beat Max Yards, but you should do well today. Maybe I can beat him, who knows? I really admire people who can hit it long. Max Yards really inspires my writing. You know, a long drive is fun, but I prefer a low score. Max Yards is rad. Max always carries the latest equipment. Watching. 
his, his, his sponsors. Watching him is like gazing into the future. Oh man, the pies are going to be gone by the time I'm done filming. <laughs> That's what he has in mind. <laughs> I, was, I was thinking like maybe he would say something like, because I'm in front of him, that I'm in front of his shot or something like that. Nah, I guess not. He's more concerned with the pies anyway. We're finally gonna get to see it! This guy rips them! Guess they're all excited to see Maxiars. I don't think my dad even hits it as far as this guy. What was she going to say when I reveal I forgot to put a new tape in the camera? Uh-oh! <laughs> this is gonna be sick! Oh man, I can't believe we're seeing this! He almost makes me want to dress appropriately! <laughs> we'll talk later. Swing soon. Stand back or you'll be caught in the slipstream. Ready to start? No. Yes, I <laughs> So I'm guessing they'll just automatically give me that long club. Let's get this thing started. Step aside, people. The master is here. Oh! Just gotta do some stretches and oh, my lumbago. I can't, I can't compete now. <laughs> Y'all came here today to witness one thing. So here it is. Woo! Oh! You killed him! Max! Great shot, buddy. That footage is going to be incredible! I just hope the camera isn't hurt. <laughs> that would have been over 300 yards, actually, based on the markers there. Poor thing took a nasty bump. You're a legend, Max! Oh, please. You give me too much credit. After all, it was these new shoes by Pure Strike that gave me the edge. Buy them now at your local retailer. <laughs> Pure action in these things is really unbound. And <laughs> it's unbound again. <laughs> and remember, they look great off the course too. I think his head might have come unbound. <laughs> How are you feeling? Ready to win this? I won't lie, coach. It is getting to me a bit. What was that flash? That was weird. Okay. I've never had so many people watching me. Oh, maybe he's getting faint or something. And I don't have those pure shoes. It has nothing to do with the equipment. Can't pivot, coach. What if I can't pivot? What if I fucking stuck in a can't pivot? Don't worry. You can pivot with the best of them. Just take off your shoes. You can never judge how a man is going to react to his first large crowd. It can be scary, but the best ones always get through it somehow. Just remember, everybody here wants you to succeed. You really think so? Hi! <laughs> well, what are you doing here? It's like mom and dad. I came to cheer you on to failure! What? And to let you know it's not going to work out between us. Oh. This here is Tobias. Say something, Tobias. Good day! Tobias owns two phone companies and five phones! Oh! That's a lot of phones. I can't compete with that. <laughs> what does that have to do with? I have six phones. I mean, no, I can't compete on phones. I need to think of something else. I have eight phones. Focus on your side. <laughs> this has nothing to do with gold, but it's entertaining nonetheless. You need to block out the distractions. Yeah, who are those two? I don't. Have you, I think you may have seen them before. Maybe. Oh. Anyway, you're right, coach. My dad told me there would always be geese to deal with. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think that was like the parents. I guess this is what he was talking about. I mean, I thought maybe that could be his mom, but she said honey, but maybe she was referring to the guy next. Go ahead, are you going to show us your hit? This is what you think you're so good at, right? No, I guess it is his parents then. But why do you... They certainly aren't very encouraging then. Don't slice, don't slice, don't slice! Just so you know. This is a really hard club to hit. Alright, so the long driver is ready. Uh, zero out of five. We're just supposed to hit past like a certain distance or something. Well, here we go! I wonder if you, I wonder if you get like better... Eh, better power if you get it more to the center of those marks or something. I don't know. Oh man, I hit it past the camera guy. Oh! That technically was further than Max Yards! Oh! <laughs> go ball, go! Okay, so that didn't quite work quite as well. So I think it is more towards the center of each of those marks, then, right? 
Let's try it. It's only so fast I can mash button mash anyway, so... Uh, no, that wasn't as effective either. So, do I hit it like further to the left side of each mark then? Let's try that. And that was horribly ineffective, and I landed on a ball. Okay, I'm not sure how to get the most out of this then. So yeah, I guess I just gotta get past the cameraman or something for the count, or something. Like maybe I just pass the 300 mark, or I don't know. <laughs> I'll just, I'll just keep smashing them, because I'm still getting success. I can work out the intricacies of the powerful club later, I guess. Because <laughs> I'm still, still finding success. Yeah! But, would that be further than max yards, though? I don't know. Does it count as, well, I mean, it did count as success, but I mean, I don't know. It sure looked like I outdrove. <laughs> um... Uh, uh, I guess, yeah. Maybe I should start working on the spin so my ball stops faster. <laughs> it's like on that Bermuda Isles with the sand around the greens. I know you all think I'm cheap, but guess what? I got a trophy made for the event. It's probably something horrible. Something that he fished out of the lake, like a shoe and a can taped together. Well, it does look like a trophy. It's a beauty. Now, we've had a bit of an upset here today. Wait a second. Hold on, hold on, hold on. He had something? I thought it was the red bandana guy that brought the prize. Interesting. Interesting. Now, we've had a bit of an upset here today. This competition was a farce, so we did beat him. I didn't know you were bringing in special equipment. What? If we were using real clubs, I'd have won. Yes, we all thought you would win. I even went so far as to have your name engraved. <laughs> well, they have to put mine on there now. So I kind of have to give it to you now. Oh, no! <laughs> no, you don't! Just polish it off and engrave mine. But what do I get? <laughs> you get to compete at the tournament tomorrow. Dance! I guess that's okay. Remember not to lose sight of your true goals. Well, we all know I won that. And that's all that matters. On a more important note, it's almost time for our dinner. Come see me in my office when you're ready. Okay. Anyone else to talk to after this competition? Maybe? This just looks like everyone everyone just like returned to the usual. Yeah, fun the blast. It's probably gonna say he would have beat you next time. Yep, yep. That's what I thought. Uh huh. So, yeah, it looks like everything has returned to normal. Um... I guess I could go check out, check him out in his office really quick to see where things are going to be taking. Uh, the direction things are going to be going, I should say. Uh, wait, wait, what am I What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm lost again. <laughs> this, the big building. Yes, PK Gam. Concentrate. You must stay focused. You must learn the areas to get around easier. Ready for dinner? No. Okay, yeah. <laughs> what are we gonna be hitting like balls across the table into our mouths like mashed potato balls or something? Uh, where is this? Well, this is the place. I hope we're not late. Oh no! They're early! Don't worry, coach. We can do this. How long have I meant to microwave the roast for? Why are there no microwave instructions? <laughs> Why did I ever think I could do this? I know nothing about cooking! Calm yourself, coach. Calm yourself, we can do this. Coach, we can do this. <laughs> Just as I said, but you have to calm down. I'll go and distract them for a bit. Just throw it in the microwave and get it out when it looks good. <laughs> That's not gonna work with a roast. I mean, I guess it'll cook it, but it won't be tasty. I imagine they're cooking away in there. Ah, uh, hi guys. Finally, we've been waiting out here for ages. You just got here. We we seen that. Wait, coach wanted us to pick some herbs from the garden. He grows his own herbs. Wow, color me impressed. Coach is practically fainting over there. Come on, what's taking so long? The one in the packet is wrapped in foil. 
now I understand. I don't see any herbs around here. It's you gotta look in in between the weeds. Yeah, they're they're over to your to your left over there. Sure you do. Look here. here there they are. That looks like a weed. <laughs> <laughs> there really is weeds. No, they're, they're, they're a bit unconventional. Yes. They're still delicious. Coach imports them from overseas. Oh, exotic. <laughs> Somehow, we're impressing her. I mean, I should say, we're used. We're, yeah, we're impressing her, but not for us, with him. Hope you're taking care of business in there, Coach. Oh! <laughs> nope, that's not right. Did I skip a step or something? Come on, get go back now. Yep. Well, can you go inside now? I think you should probably check first. Of course. Oh! We might want to go and eat out today. Oh! It's done. <laughs> Come on, it's freezing out here. It doesn't look that cold. I mean, look, everything's in full bloom. I'll just open the door. I bet there's gonna be a plume of smoke. Yep. <laughs> well, he tried his best. So, uh, how's the roast? A little, uh, you put a lot of flavor into it. It's got extra flavor. Mmm, good. Mm. Exotic herbs are... <coughs> wow, grassy! Apologies if it's a bit overdone. I got distracted sitting the table. Mine is lovely, coach. Well, the big day is tomorrow. Things might be a bit hectic when you get to the course. You need to find the sign-up desk when you get there. And you'll be taken to the first tee. What do you mean, find the sign-up desk? You've been to every location so far, I, I think. Well, look at the time. We should get going. Yes, me too. Pink had nothing to say about that? <laughs> I would have thought Lana would have had a little been like the first one to say something about that. Oh, oh. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. We're good, we're good. <laughs> just, just didn't quite whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't press any buttons that time, that just happened. So maybe maybe when I pressed the B button before, I maybe what was supposed to happen was I was supposed to be in bed the whole time after those transitions, but the black screen transition was off-timed, and I was already standing on the floor, then I went back in the bed, and then I came out of the bed, but I should have been in bed before the black screen transition ended, and ah, I don't know! I don't know, all I know is I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when it looks like we're gonna be starting the Well-Worn Grove Open tournament then. Sure looks like it at least. Who knows, I mean this game throws all sorts of curveballs at you. 